hey welcome to this video in this video i'm going to show you the new e-commerce sales page and funnel hack that you need to start using right now this new funnel hack is being used by very few nigerians right now and very few persons in africa right now and those of us who are using it have seen massive increase in our sales i'm not going to say 5x or 10x increase or 20x increase by the end of this video you are going to see it yourself and i'm sure you'll be so glad you watch this video my name is joshua Mba. i'm not here to talk about myself my goal is to show you this and why am i doing this i'm doing this because this community deserves to be the first set of persons to use awesome tools resources and any new stuff out there because the kind of persons who are in this community are great minds awesome persons who deserve to be the first set of people to use any stuff that comes out new and of course it's a new system and very few persons are using right now in nigeria to confirm this i'll be showing you the old version of sales process being used in the e-commerce industry i'm going to translate to the new one that i want to introduce to you all right so stick with me through this video i'm going to show you this massive massive new funnel approach all right i'm going to take you into two sections i'll be very brief i'm going straight to the point there's no long story right here i'll show you the theoretical aspect of this funnel show you the laws and the rule of laws that guide this funnel both the old one that is in work right now and the new one i'm trying to introduce to you and then we'll do a practical session where i'll show you how it's been implemented please make sure you watch this video to the end i guarantee you you will remain grateful after watching this video right so this is the current e-commerce funnel that is invoked right now what i'm saying is the current one is out of 50 ads you're going to see 45 are using this funnel all right so what you're going to see let me zoom into my screen please you're going to see an advertisement on your timeline if you just check this after this video you just check your timeline. you're going to see this all right so you see e-commerce guys those who are selling products online running facebook ads and uh, instagram ads for their products you're going to see them running sending traffic to their sales page right and on their sales page you're going to see you will see a form all right and all that form where you have to fill in your name email address phone number add um, um, every of your contact information then you click on order now all right you're going to choose whether one pack of the product two pack of the product or three pack of the product if you are conversant with this i would like you to just drop a comment that you've you've seen this all right if you if if you've seen this kind of stuff and if of course you can agree with me that that's the common in fact like i said out of 50 45 of us are going to see for products follow the same process all right so and after that they're going to send you to a thank you page this is what is invoked now and if you are spending ten dollars as what i said ten thousand naira, not dollar let me just um let me bring it down to naira all right so if you are spending ten thousand naira on a daily budget for your ads and you're bringing them to this sales page you're going to end up making them to buy this product and then send it to a thank you page and they walk away and you do the follow-up to deliver your product fine this funnel is cool so many persons of course i used to use it and i've used it to generate some cool cash all right so a, a lot of us have also used this same process to generate millions of naira all right so i'm not saying this funnel doesn't work totally but i'm going to show you something that is super cool that will increase your sales i'm not going to tell you 5x 10x 20x but you're going to see the number of x is going to increase your sales before the end of this video all right so this is the one that is invoked right now and what just in case you don't know what is being used to get this kind of result is stuff like tools um wordpress tools like the wp forms for the form or huge it forms are there are so many form um wordpress form plugins all right and before they used to use as even 2019 the insta builder was one of the most common sales page design tools in nigeria even across africa then in 2020 travel architect late 2019 and in 2020 travel architect took over the whole space massively and right now Elementor is also con um, um, competing massively. In fact, it's stopping in the tool being used to design sales space. That's not my topic today, but just that's on the lighter note for those who want to take note of that. So this is the old or the, the sales funnel invoke right now. But I want to show you this new one that very few persons are using and you should be using it right now. All right, let me show you. Now, this is the new sales funnel for e-commerce product remember i'm saying e-commerce i'm not I'm, I'm i'm not here to talk about any other industry i'm focusing on the e-commerce industry all right for so if you are into the e-commerce industry please make sure if you are not into the e-commerce industry 
of course you have an opportunity to join us in the industry all right so this is a new sales phone i'm going to break it down to you explaining the rule of law and everything that consigns this phone I'm, I'm going to do it as quick as possible all right now the first step in this phone is to send traffic to your sales page but our goal is not to make them check out on the sales page all right i'm going to show you practical illustrations so just chill all right and also in this phone we also provide a system that allows us to send organic traffic to the sales page i'm going to show you a typical illustration so our goal is to send traffic on the sales page with our good copy of course you should have a good copy and your cta properly placed in the sales page we then send them to the checkout page all right now the advantage is that on the once they land on the checkout page our sales page our sales copy should be super compelling and of course drag them to the sell, checkout page once they land on the checkout page our goal is to get their details and also in this sales phone here with the tools available we are also giving the opportunity to include an order bump and the goal is to increase the order quantity so if the the sales the product is just like a one pack product or two let's say it's in quantity one or two or is in packs let's say one pack or two pack at the end of the day you want them to increase the number of packs they are going to order on the checkout page so let's say the product is sold at twenty five thousand naira. i'm going to give them an option to add extra one on the checkout point before they hit the place order and of course what we do at this point is to even include a discount so we can include a discount of five thousand naira, six thousand naira. why it won't affect us is because it's the same amount of money to take us to ship the product or deliver that product to the customer all right so delivering one product and delivering two of those products is relatively depending although it depends on the product but on a, on a general note it's the same amount of money you are going to spend so we can then of course remove the delivery fee and of course even remove extra one box or two box to make them buy this um, include extra of the order or sometimes even add two three more on their checkout cart on their cart all right at this checkout point all right so i'm going to show you illustration but after that what we are doing is once they click on place order we send them to an offset remember they are still the process it was the same amount of money we spent on facebook ad to bring them into this funnel is still the same amount of money that the guy who is using the old funnel is still spending and once we get them to this offset our goal is to set the best related product and most times always that's why it's called an offset it should be higher in price compared to the product we are trying to sell on the sales page as at this point we are not trying to write a compelling sales copy again to sell this product all we just need to do is to give them a clean offer when i mean clean offer I give them scarcity and then give them a, a massive discount on the product and you see they're going to opt in for this product now that's step two or step three now after now we have two options if now it depends on the logic i'm going to show you that logic if the customer accepts the upsell one then we can now trigger upsell two which is another related product that is way higher than upsell one all right so we trigger upsell two but when we check the logic on, on, on setting up the phone name and the user or the customer declines upsell one can then send them to the down sale which is a product that is cheaper in price compared to the product we have sold on the sales page and of course remember stick to including discount and scarcity on that page there's no long sales copy here just show them how this product on the sales page works with this one you're trying to say right now and the necessity for them to merge the two to get the best result that's the goal all right and after now what we do is now we send them to a thank you page so depending on the process all right that means we have one two three four items four products you are selling in one single sales process and once we send it to the thank you page we don't just let them go we do what i call the locking plan where we capture them and keep them forever and the advantage of this sales process which i'll be showing you again is it gives us the opportunity to capture those without running and without getting at those who got to the checkout point and couldn't complete their order so once what we do is that once we capture them here they did not place order again they just filled in their information probably because of one reason or the other most times it's because of network browser or whatever could have happened they lose track of the order most times their facebook will just refresh all right starts happen that way all right so 
what happens is that in 30 minutes we trigger a follow-up email because they have captured their data without them even submitting we trigger a follow-up email that follow-up email goes ahead of or ahead to lure them back to complete their order from the checkout point all right i'm going to show you the practical right i'm just trying to explain the theory and then we sequence other email so just in case the person did not complete the order after the first 30 minutes email that goes out we sequence email that will go on a daily basis until we close the sale and what we do just to follow up the process is we then add a phone call follow-up we ensure that there's a phone call follow-up to make sure that the customer buys the product so that's what we do in this sales process as you see as you can see if i'm spending ten thousand naira on ads to send them to this sales page all right at the end of the day let's say this product is twenty five thousand naira instead of me just making twenty five thousand naira for this sales process i'm going to make twenty five thousand here probably thirty five thousand here probably ten thousand naira here and five thousand naira here and at the end of the day i'm making more in one single sales process with the same amount of budget on my facebook or instagram or google ads or any ads you are using to send them to your sales page do you get it now all right so there are wonderful tools that makes this very possible which i'm going to show you quickly they are the cash flow if you're using the cash flow pro version that's super cool that means you're going to have um, access to the pro tools there all right but you can still use the cash flow the free version to do a lot uh, a lot of the things i've already mentioned in this funnel the elementary the pro version is to, will be very cool for you and the woocommerce and a very good copy all right these are the major these are the four things you need to get this thing done immediately right now i'm going to head over to my browser to just show you a quick demonstration of how this works all right so welcome so very quickly because of time sake i'm going to rush it now this is my wordpress um, backend uh, administrative section of my wordpress website all right so I, I just want to show you the two i mentioned for you that that is being used for this sales um funding that makes all of this stuff achievable for us is the cart flow right the cart flow flow plugin all right that's it here so you can actually get it online and install get the pro version if you yeah get the pro version and use all right Okay, so this is it. Now, first of all, this is the flow. I'm going to show you how, how I arrived here very quickly. This is the landing page. This is the checkout page. This is the upsell page. All right, this is the upsell one. This is the downsell. There's no upsell two in this particular phone. We only we are only using one upsell. This is the downsell and this is the thank you page. All right, so this is a demonstration of how the flow is. All right, let me show you how we set up the flow. So let me click on add um, add a new flow. Okay, let me just do open this on a new tab very quickly and then i'm going to add click on add new all right so when i click on add new i'm going to see existing templates this is for people of course who will find it very difficult to start setting it up from scratch of course a lot of persons already like um, the done for you stuff all right so there are a lot of te ex existing templates already um, designed for you by cut in conjunction with elementor all right so these stuff are already here all we need to do is to get it get the ones we want and then implement it all right so let's go for this i'm going to show you i'm going to use the preview feature just to show you how it works very quickly and then um just to make this video very short all right so this is this is the template we would have um let, let me let me use one that will give us opportunity to look at the offset let me use this all right okay so this has a, an upsell and also has a down sale all right so this is the page this is the landing page let's say you've already done your editing of course when you import this you can actually edit it to suit what you want all right this is just a template that i've given for you all right so after you've gone through the landing page this is the sales page where you do every put up all your copies and every blah 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 you want to say all your testimonials then this is the checkout page now remember why what i told you about the checkout page there, there's a, an opportunity for us to track people who could not complete their checkout and then follow them up that's an advantage and right here you can also include an order bump this is how an order bump look like looks like sorry so before this is when they are filled in their information all right they're feeding their information and before they just please click on place order they're going to get a write-up here it's going to be a very compelling write-up and this is a demo please all right add extra two or one and get ten thousand extra discount five thousand extra discount and once they click on yes i will take it the system adds one more for them all right all right 
as one more or any other product you want to sell out at this point you call it the order bomb all right before they click on the place order now from here after they have clicked on place order you want to take them to the upsell now this is the upsell one very quickly so in the upsell we are not doing a lot of talking like we did in the landing page we are just going to give them the product give them the discount you're offering them and give them opportunity to add it and remember we are going to create the connection of this product with the primary product we are trying to sell and even if the person declines or accepts he or she will be then because we have the next step is the downstairs we send to the downstairs um, right here and then you close up your sales after the downstairs we head over to the thank you page so that's how the flow works in one flow you can sell three to four products and make 3x 5x 10x result extra revenue for yourself in one sales process that's how it works so if you're implementing if you're not implementing this flow this sales process i just showed you right now you are losing a lot of money if you're in the e-commerce industry in fact you can apply this same strategy in any other industry but for the e-commerce guys you really have to start applying this because this is a game changer for us in the industry so make sure you're using cash flow you have your elementor installed your WooCommerce, of course, and everything is set up in place. All right, thank you very much for this video. I'm very, very glad that you stayed with me to the end of this video, and I hope you learned something. I'm very, very sure you actually learned something. All right, so just to cap it up, my name is Joshua Mba. You can you're free to reach out to me at any time. Thank you, and see you in the next video. Some other time.